Red flag is out and away we go. Down the back straightaway, two by two by two. As they look at the turn, number three and four for the first time, it's going to be Dan Dresser, the Woody Thompson on zero nine. So you have to go again. Rocco rides in two, D'Alfonso and third, cling back to fourth. So look off turn number two down the back straight away. And off the turn, Jess, Rocco rides in a red jump and cling in fourth. Caution rates are on the first yellow flag of all of qualifying. Pace truck will duck back into the infield. Dresso and Bronco will pick up the pace. At the fourth quarter under the drag ship, green flag is up on the way. Racing resumes two by two by two off turn number two. Don Dresso still your race leader. Bronco once again applying the pressure on the top side of the speedway. Works it into turns number three and four. Dresso has the lead. Bronco in second. Alfonso in third. Jason on the ship. It's running in fourth. Bronco looking for the lead down the back straightaway. Into three and four. David Bronco downstairs. Down Dresso up on the little sway from Dresso. And Bronco's going to run half the lead in the back row. Alfonso fell about, he'll settle behind in third. Here comes Mark Cook back on the outside. Mark Cook's turned up the wick down the back straight away. So we're working to turns number three and four. So we're working off the fourth quarter onto the main straight away. Baraka, Jossel, Hook, one, two, three. Dilly in fourth and the Shevitz in fifth. Here with three laps to go. Bronco still up front, but the heavy hitters in the division are coming. Mark Cook to the outside, Dan Jason downstairs. Two laps to go, and Bronco's trying to make that 20 in as wide as possible. So we're working off the second quarter. Hook is looking for a way down the back straightaway. Into turns number three and four. Defense on dress on the outside. Bronco and Hook battle for the lead. Mark Cook's got the lead. Defense up in the air. Four more turns in a row. And David Bronco's back down on the bottom of the track. Working it off the second turn down the back straightaway. Into turns number three and four. Hook's got to poke the Bimini Blue on the seven up front. Here comes Bronco off turn number four. Then drive race. Hook. We work off to number four, second hit for the straight stocks on the way. Division rookie Alex Barakowski is going to inch ahead of the field and work it down the back straight away for the first time. And Nick Robson's going to split the difference. Going into turn number three, a man removed for Nick Wilshans as he'll take the lead here on lap number one. Bronkowski to the outside, covers Lee Stone, wheel to wheel for second. Alex is going to take over the right off position. And now here comes Tim Wilshans in the 32, covers Lee, going to lose that time. Wilshans will exchange lines without the turn signal. He'll put to even terms now against the Bronkowski 72. So we work off turn number four, back to the line, and the Wilshans for division one, two. Chris Handley racing in third in the 94. Bronkowski there in fourth, fifth, Jimmy LaFleur. Garrett Clevers and Bob Palmer at the back as we work it down the back straight away. Chris Handley, half a car length behind the Tim Martians, 32, Nick Turner, and this and again. Bronco and Hook in the street stocks are flying with the last possible inch of race to the racetrack. 
as they swing off turn number four, the difference between getting onto the asphalt and the concrete of the drag strip. So they work off turn of number four. Chris Hadley trying to get underneath Tim Washington for the runner up position. Can't seem to pull the trigger this time. She worked down the back straight away, and now Hanley trying to work it to the inside again. Russian still answering the charge. Then the way to run off to number four. Tim slipped it high. Chris Hanley will take advantage. Chris Hanley in second, and now Tim Russian's trying to apply the pressure and regain the runner up position as his brother Nick leads him by a half a straight away. Two laps to go for Nick Rochelle. Hanley and Rochelle still a closest battle on the racetrack there for the number two spot. Bob Palmer will work his way around. Garrett Clover's going to move up a position. Rochelle's and Manly bands on move to the bottom, trying to get around the headway. Now Nick the little white flag is up in the air. It's in quick, going to get to the right bumper. Over the Hadley 94, white flag is up in the air. And the home away from home, Kenneth 41 on his way to the heat one again. Off two, number three, and four, final time. Check a flag. Nick Rochelle's will win heat race. Number two, the race. Second to the line, Will B. Chris Hanley, third, Will B. Tim Walshins, Alex Markowski, fourth place finish for him. Jim Wilfrey, fifth, Bob Palmer. Throwing heat race number three. All four scheduled tonight for the street stocks. So we'll go off turn number four with Myers and Kosher, so we'll run into the green. Formation they go off turn number two for the first time. Dave Johnson trying to go for a ride with Wetland and never thought of it. Had to back out of it. Outside wide's gonna go. Kyle Shoshik's gonna lead. Welcome to the world. Boys form out a little too early, especially when they're going up in the heels. I know you can't hear me now, but if you watch the video, we'll probably have a 51 lap feature coming up. Don't want to drive like Tim Lang's now, so we're getting off the turn here, second by side for the number two spot. And they're battling for the lead. Gary Bartel in the three. And the last lap will be Gary Bartel. Kyle Shoshik in second three. Wetland's gonna smack the double palm. As we get ready to go, two complete. Six more to go in the start of four. Rounds of qualifying tonight for the budget of the Atlanta Buffalo Street Stock Screen Lights. Dave Johnson cutting the corner, going into turn number one under the Rick Meyer 68 there off the brakes. And Johnson up to second. Kyle Shoshik leads in the 19, going into turn number three. Shoshik got a little too happy that time. So working off the corner. Dave Johnson in second. Here comes Gary Bartella fighting back with the Golden Wales, number four and one. Meanwhile, Johnson wants the lead. Going into turn number three, Dave Johnson and Kyle Shoshik will have a run for the race lead off turn number four. No race lead off, it's Dave Johnson. Dave Johnson from sixth to the lead off turn number two. A little goodbye. No look at down the back, show it away. Shoshik now in second, back to in third. Tommy Wetland in fourth, Rick Myers in the fifth position. Wetland also has got J.D. Emery Madling on the side of the race car up on the hood.
Speed Enterprises Entertainment as well. So working in turns number three and four, but it is Dave Johnson. Up and forward. And the KDM Construction 57. Kyle Shoshik still rides in two, but Tilt continuing to run in third. So work off the number four corner on to the main straight away. White flag is up in the air. One for the triple over the stock going Castro Oval. Dave Johnson, you're the slider down the back stretch. We're working to turn number four. Off corner four. Final time. Check a flag. Dave Johnson in for one. Second is going to show you a big game for Tony Whitland. Rick Myers will complete your top five. Three, get ready to go. Chris Barber, Keith Flynn again, it's your time. Working off the second corner, they're two by two down the back straight away. Flying again in the green, 35, Barber in the red, white, and blue zero, right off turn number four. They'll drag us to the right and get the right to keep flying again. Flying again got a little tear up as they got off the drag strap. Barber to the inside, Gustafson running in third. Pick a rally back to the fourth position. Dylan Carbone in fifth off turn number four. We'll click another one on the counter. So you're down the back stretch into three and four. Barbara and Gustafson run a one for two spot. So we're getting off the turn. Gusty going to inch ahead, going into turn number one, but Barber fighting right back on the bottom. The custom shock and suspension has to on the sides of the Barber's own run. So we we'll off turn number four. This one is Keith Flanagan's. Working down the back straight away, Gustafson rides in two, Barber third, pick around fourth. So they go we all the way, they go single fire formation. Pick around, I thought about looking to the inside of Chris Barber, couldn't do it last time, but we'll see what happens this time. Here with three laps to go, and now pick around, we'll look to the inside of Barber, they'll drag it down the back straight away. Into turns number three and four, back to the line, two laps to go. Piccolo and Barber, battle for four, they'll cross each other up. The Piccolo has the position. Meanwhile, battle for the lead, shaping up to be a good one here in the late stages. Gustafson, turning up the wick on the 35, a key flag and white flags up in here. Flanagan's getting on the inside, running into turn number one. Flanagan will slam the door shut as they look off the second corner. Down the back, straight away. Into turn number three, half turn number four. Full time checkered flag, give the win to Keith Flanagan. Gusta sitting for two. Bickerley, Bolivar, Carbone. And Mike Rogers, we're well, holding up Nathan Bryant.